this video, we'll demonstrate how to assemble the field wireable connectors. Before beginning your installation, be sure to read the field wireable connector quick install guide on Enphase.com. For the purpose of this demonstration, we'll be using a male connector. First, use the width of the nut to mark the cable at 27 millimeters. Insulation will be stripped to 27 millimeters in an upcoming step. Slide the nut over the cable. Make sure the gasket is pre-installed inside the cover, then slide the cover and the gasket over the cable. To attach the terminals to the cable, start by stripping the outer sheathing or jacket to 27 millimeters, or 1 and 1 16th of an inch. And strip the inner insulation to 9.5 millimeters, or 3 eighths of an inch. Load the open end of each terminal in the 12 gauge slot of the crimp tool, flush with the edge of the slot. Warning, the cable sheathing must extend completely through the gasket when the body is assembled, and the gasket must fully cover the cable sheathing to prevent moisture from entering the connector. Crimp the end of the terminal over the stripped copper wires. Do not crimp over the insulation. Here is an example of how the wires should look after they are crimped. Next, insert the terminals into the connector body. Each terminal should click firmly into place. Do a tug test to make sure they are secure. The inside of your male field wireable connector will look the same as the inside of your Q cable connector once assembly is complete. If you'd like, you can use the Q cable as reference for assembling your male field wireable connector. Assemble the connector body and cover. Listen for a click as they engage. Do a tug test to make sure the connector body and cover are secure. Tighten the nut to seven Newton meters with channel lock pliers or a torque wrench. The field wireable connector is now assembled. Great job.